I'm going to show you how to draw the present day modern model. We're going to do two atoms. First one that we're going to do, I want you to take a look at page 960 in your Glencoe Earth Science book, and that'll show you the periodic table. I want you to look at period two, group one, and there you will find the data box for lithium. The atomic number is three. Atomic mass is six, nine, four, one. We need to find the number of protons, neutrons, and electrons before we can draw the model. number of protons, the clue is we look at the atomic number, which is here, three. Electrons is equal to the number of protons in all neutral atoms. So if we have three protons, we have three electrons. For neutrons, we have to take the atomic mass, we round it to the nearest whole number, then we subtract the atomic number. So, the atomic mass is here. We have to look at this digit after the decimal. If it is higher than a 5, that means that we round up. So 7 is our atomic mass. And we're going to subtract the atomic number, which is 3, which gives us 7 minus 3 equals 4 neutrons. So we have 3 protons, 3 electrons, 4 neutrons. Now we're going to draw the, the modern day model. And I have my elect electron cloud. Give me one minute. The electron cloud, we don't actually see it. Uh, we don't actually see a circle or anything, but it is a shaded area um, on here so that you can tell that's what it is, the electron cloud. And again, we have three protons and three electrons. So let's take care of that first. So I'm going to put my electron symbol here, and we're going to just write the number 3 next to it. So we know we have three electrons in the electron cloud. We have three protons, and we need to create three protons, which is circles with pluses in them. And then we had four neutrons, which we're going to shade those so we can tell the difference. Okay, we'll double check again. Three protons, four neutrons in the nucleus, and three electrons. Three protons, four neutrons, three electrons. That is your modern day model of lithium. Let's do one more. I'm going to actually go back up here. So we're going to do how to draw the modern model. Just 
time we're going to take a look at the data box for the element beryllium, group 2, period 2. It's a period, uh, has an atomic number of 4, atomic mass of 9.0122. We're figure out how many protons, electrons, and neutrons. Protons. We look at the atomic number. That gives us the number of protons. For electrons, we look at the number of protons. It's equal to that. For neutrons, we take the mass minus the atomic number. So we got to look at the mass. We look at the digit past the decimal, and we have to ask ourselves if it's 5 or higher, we round up. If it's not, we stay the same, so it is still 9, and we subtract the atomic number, which is 4, which gives us 5 neutrons. So when we go to make our modern day model, again, we have 4 protons, 5 neutrons in the nucleus. So we're going to put five, four protons here, and five neutrons. Then we're going to put our E here for our electrons, and we have four electrons. This is the modern model for beryllium.